projects they learned in their science classes to eager parents and fellow students. The projects included a kaleidoscope, color wheels, dissecting, 
hot air balloons, gloop, and many other interesting and ex educational experiments. She performed a violin solo and received a $25 gift certificate. Besides being the Big 8 art conference show, there's also been other competitions for the Monet High School students. It's called the Top 25 Works. And Mr. Reimer, could you explain? Thank you again, Chrissy. We did something a little bit different this year. We considered an art show for just Monet High School art students, and we called it the Top 25. All Monet High School art students could submit work to be considered for this art show, and we ended up with about a hundred different works. And so the students submitted their work, and then we had a judge come in. It was a high school art teacher that is acquainted with students' work and so forth. And this judge came in, looked at all the work, and considered all the work, and picked out of all of those hundred works, 25 works, which we can say the top works of Monet High School of this year. Could it, be, could it have been any student's work it from be, Art One? Yes, Chrissy, it concluded all students, Art One students through advanced students, everyone had a chance to submit their work. And of those works selected, of the 25, there were several works considered for or selected from Art One students. In addition to the top 25, then, we had the judge select number one, number two, and number three. The number one selection for the judge was Greg Edwards. Uh, Greg Edwards received the number one for this uh, ink landscape. He also received the first place on that at the Big 8 Conference Art Show. Mm -hmm. And the second place went to a T.J. Rockers. He did an industrial scene in uh, oil pastel. This is Gregory Edwards' first place pen ink. This is T.J. Rocker's second place oil pastel. And this is Shauna Higgs' third place oil pastel.
The Monad Speech and Debate team had a rather grim showing at the Neosho Speech and Debate Tournament. After all, they only took two trophies. Rachel Anderson and Elizabeth Mildred's fourth place duet acting, Hen Aaron Washburn's first place Lincoln Douglas debate. Although this seemed rather nauseating going into districts, we had a fine turnout after all, starting out with our first ever Reader's Theater performance, which took fourth place. Here's a sample. The rest of the Misha District Tournament turned out fine, too. Out of the seven individual events, we had finalists in six of them, everything but radio speaking. In the two debate formats, we had a third place team debater and a second place and a fourth place Lincoln-Douglas debater. Here are the rest of the results from Misha District. 